Hello friends, and welcome to the Global Defense. In today's episode we will discuss about Maldives receives renowned Turkish drones amid India tensions. Turkey has initiated the provision of its well-known combat drone, the Bayraktar TV-2, to the Maldives, amidst heightened tensions between the island nation and India. As per the agreement between the two countries, the supply includes a command control station along with six TB-2 unmanned combat aerial vehicles, UCAVs, to fulfill the security needs of the Maldivian armed forces. This move follows the visit of Maldives President Mohamed Muizu to Turkey in November 2023, during which he engaged in discussions with President Recep Tayyip Erdogan and visited various Turkish defense industry firms. The decision to supply drones comes amidst escalating tensions between the Maldives and India since Muizu assumed power last year. Traditionally aligned with India, the Maldives has been shifting towards Beijing's sphere of influence since Muizu's election, with a pledge to end the country's pro-India stance. Muizu has raised concerns about the presence of Indian troops in his country and urged New Delhi to withdraw its approximately 80 military personnel, stationed there for technical and medical assistance. The Bayraktar TB-2 drones, developed by Baykar, have proven instrumental in various conflicts worldwide, including in Azerbaijan, Libya, and Ukraine, where they notably countered Russian forces during the initial stages of Moscow's invasion. These drones have propelled Turkey into a significant global supplier in defense, aligning with Erdogan's vision of a self-reliant defense industry covering UCAVs, fighter jets, and warships. The Bayraktar TB-2 has been sold to around 33 countries to date, including members of NATO and the EU. Baykar has also inked deals with nine nations for its Akinci UCAV, the more advanced counterpart of TB-2, representing Turkey's most sophisticated drone. Capable of flying for over 20 hours at an altitude of 27,000 feet, the TB-2 can carry a payload of up to 120 kilograms while weighing only 650 kilograms. It has gained recognition for its capability to neutralize advanced anti-aircraft systems, artillery, and armored vehicles. Baycar reported record exports worth $1.76 billion in 2023, contributing to over 30% of the total sales of Turkish defense companies, which reached approximately $5.5 billion. So friends, this was about today's podcast. If you like our podcasts, do subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon. Support the independent unbiased media so that we can continue to bring latest military and geopolitical news. Thank you for listening.